What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Braid Tone. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing guys the top three ways to fix lag when you're playing games on the Ryu Jinx emulator. But before we get started this video, please make sure guys you would like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Now, first things first, everything you guys will need will be in the description down below from um, certain applications I showcase you guys the 4K resolution mod and also the 60 FPS mod. So as you guys go along with the video, I want you guys to basically get those applications and also follow along with the video. All right, so first things first, we're gonna go to options. The options tab, then we go to the settings. Now, you guys, <laughs> if um, most of you guys are familiar with the Ryu Jinx emulator, there's not much you can do compared to Yuzu, which you can, which you can do um, a little bit, I'll say 80% more <laughs> with the settings and the graphics in the system tab. But what's really unique about the Ryu Jinx emulator is you can play games in 4K and then you can use a mod to even enhance it. But that's with um, people with basically strong PCs, but if you're using on the low end side, I'll suggest using the native. Native is pretty good. And then when you're in um, system, enable VSync and shared cast are probably, in my opinion, the two most important ones because when you're making shared cast, when you're making shared cast with the games you're playing over and over, it's gonna make it more stable, especially if you're playing on a low end PC. So these these two things, in my opinion, are very important. And after you do that, you just apply it and then you save it. And then next, like I said um, before, in the description, I'm going to be leaving you guys 60 FPS mod and 4K mod. All right, I'm just open up the 4K mod real quick. Drag and drop that. I'm going to close that. Minimize that. So how does basically work? You're going to open, you're going to left click um, the game. Mod data location open. 60 FPS. And 4K. Next, I did that. Next thing, what, which is going to be the third and final way, is the video control panel. Now, I'm not going to go into too much detail how this basically works. If you guys watch my previous videos, this should be a no brainer to you guys. Always use your graphics card 1050, just image settings. Always use performance over quality, no matter what. Basically apply it. Manage DD settings. Now this is kind of tricky for, I, I know that with um, people that have a pretty decent graphics card, I use high performance graphics processor. Default settings should be good. Go to program settings. Now, in this case, if you have a low end PC, I'll say try to use this, the high performance, um, using the global settings, due to the fact that, in my experience, on a low end PC, I have, um, for some reason, a better experience using this setting. And then just go down, default settings is basically good, you don't need to change much. And after that, you basically apply it. Wait a little bit, and and basically you're all set to go. So that's pretty much it on basically the top three ways to fix lag on the Ryu Jinx emulator. So <laughs> yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to like, share, also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. And yeah, guys, this is your boy Braidstone. See you guys in the next video. Peace out.